Hi, I'm Holly Alexander, and this is the Maximo Minute. When a user is trying to access Maximo, by default, you do have to add the slash Maximo onto the end for them to be redirected to the login page. If that Maximo is left off, then they're greeted with this nice forbidden error. And I will show you how to prevent them from getting this forbidden error instead being uh, taken to the login screen. First, we will navigate to the IBM HTTP server configuration file directory. This is a Linux system. By default, the configuration files reside in OPT IBM HTTP server conf. If you're on a Windows system, then the OPT part will be replaced with a drive letter, usually D or E. So within this directory, we'll see this httpd.conf. This is the master configuration file. We'll go ahead and open it up. Before you edit the httpd.conf, you will want to take a backup of it. Go ahead and view it. First, we're going to search for the redirect section. We are going to add a line, redirect match, using the redirect directive. If you know regular expressions, you'll recognize that. Uh, if the start and the end match a slash, which would be the root directory, which would be if they don't specify anything after the host name. So if they don't specify anything after the host name, then instead of throwing that forbidden error, we'll want to then redirect them to Maximo Web Clients, login, login.jsp, which is the login page. Case is uh, important, so make sure that the case is correct. Go ahead and close that. Now we'll go and restart the HTTP server. If you're on a Windows system, this will be a Windows service called IBM HTTP server within this directory. When you change the HTTP.com file, it's always a good idea to check your syntax before you deploy it on a Linux system, this is the command, and now I get syntax OK, so I didn't make any typos. If you're on a Windows system, you'd use httpd.exe space hyphen t. All right, now that our syntax is good, we can stop Apache, start it back up. It's a very slim program, so it restarts very quickly. And so now when we just go to the root, we don't see that forbidden anymore, and we are redirected to the Maximo login screen.